This week, the channels asks, should State Street stay open to pedestrians after the pandemic? I think State Street should stay open. I mean, to go back to the way it was before right now, I think it'd be a rush because we don't know what's going to happen in the next year or so with this thing. They're saying we might have a vaccine. A lot of people are saying, well, don't rush it. I do think it's beneficial for everyone just for peace and sanity to just have a little time to walk around. And if the city could keep this open, I think that would be a good thing. Just, you know, enforcing masks and social distancing. But I do think it's a good idea. Yeah, I could see like this, just like being like this and they like build out, you know, more legit like barriers or just like become like a every other weekend in Santa Barbara kind of thing, almost like a ramped up farmer's market. The absence of cars, the absence of, you know, the smelling of exhaust, the roars of Harley Davidson's going up and down State Street. When you go down by the beach where it's still open, you really recognize the difference. Like you can smell the exhaust. You can't, now up here you can smell food being cooked in the restaurants. You can hear birds chirping. It's just peaceful. It's all, like a whole different vibe. I think you should stay open this way 100% just because because downtown is very stagnant and no one really came downtown and I feel just life has come back to downtown. Even during the circumstances that we have being during a pandemic and just having things being different and everyone have to wear masks and things, but it's just, I think it would be, I, everyone would benefit from the city, from us, tourists, everyone, locals, I think, so. It just makes a lot of sense. It seems like it's worked well. Hopefully it's, you know, bringing more people by the businesses and helping increase their revenue and especially in a tough time, they need the space to be outdoors. People just feel more comfortable if they're not packed into each other inside and you open up these streets, I mean, they do it in Rome, they have boulevards, I mean, the Via Veneto in Italy is one of the most famous places and you don't drive cars around there. You know, it's all for the pedestrians. So my fear as a business owner on State Street is you make this permanent and you don't put any protections in for the local businesses that are down here and suddenly the rent skyrockets. I can see 20, 25% more and it, I can see it demolishing the local business ownership on State Street. And the only people that'll be able to afford it are big corporations and the chains, which is exactly what we don't want on State. 